Ah, de otro. Go. Hey. Greetings, man. Downtown. You just met the Sponginator.
So that Bubble. We'd sleep dream. I don't know what's happening, man. Shit. That was so slow. What's up, man? How's it going? Yeah. Hey, Gretel. Thanks for the 21. I'm doing okay, man. Hope you're having a good one as well. Yeah, from the greatest hits reel. Yeah, I like that. Nice 
move by SpongeBob. This match is just about over. Sling! The old clothesline move. Thanks, William, for the 17 months. Good to see you. A little bit far to the right, but the idea is there. Maybe it'll work eventually. I test this spot enough to be sure that it's not going to fall out? Guess we'll find out.
one. Monkey ball, huh? Maybe I host somebody who was playing it. Nothing. Welcome I was just playing this. Okay, what's up? Yeah, I'm doing all right. Just doing some runs, trying to get better at the game, you know? Yeah, maybe at some point. to the wrong thing again. SpongeBob's in for a rough ride. Out there. Ow. 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 
dough and around you go. Bob on Frozen! Yo, yeah, what's up? It's going okay. Still going for a bit longer.
The Mermelan. security. Ha 
time. Two years running. Thank you. Here we are at...
I felt like it was way too early. I actually PD. Oh. I missed chest bounce on that run too. Wow. This is um this is weird. This feels weird. I was only plus fourteen on forty-three pace going into that graveyard and I lost like fifteen seconds in there. Oh my god. This could have been so much better. I I threw this run, wow. I didn't even realize this was like somewhat okay. Still don't even feel like I PB'd. Guess I can show people the the route. And the PB cam is relevant. We we've we've changed this route like three times in the past th three days. My. Uh. But yeah, a retime's not going to make that faster. 44:27 is definitely the final time. That's an eight second, 8.5 second PB. 
some of average is going to be inaccurate because I move stuff around and delete stuff. Oh, this was the run where I... <laughs> I... I Ah, uh, I haven't done oil skip in so long. But that was definitely the strat to get more runs. I need to get more runs so I can get more 43 paces in, in late game. Like, late game 43 paces. Um, the school lagoon was passable. Alright, so like, we lost like 5 seconds up to here, then we lost like 5 more here. Huh, this was a really good industrial park. I didn't even, I wasn't even thinking about that. Five seconds. Excuse me, I said, 10 seconds? Yeah. Uh, this was pretty bad. I'd say like 10 more seconds. 20 seconds. This was good. I like this. This sucked. I grabbed the ledge. Ugh. Like 22. Oh my god, this graveyard was so bad. Oh. I still got a 213. What did I do to get a 213? I got the I got the <laughs> I got the L control and I still got a 213. That's so stupid. I guess my movement was really bad. All right, so 22 um 37 seconds. Yeah, I have like 37 seconds without quick slick and then that's an extra four because we're doing it early. Two seconds slower, earlier in the run. Choose it as an option if you get bad RNG in the beginning of the game, which is way better thanks to that lasso strat that I hope I remember to do in this run because I've been past, like, what did I come up with that, like yesterday morning, yesterday afternoon. Yeah, something like that. I hope I did it because it, it looks cool. Show people on YouTube. I just had a I had a weird feeling this run was gonna PB. I had a weird feeling. Just like doing an extra run. I was feeling pretty okay about this stuff. Yeah. Um Let's see, let's see. Yeah, it, like straight up like 35 seconds, 40 seconds that I can save readily. But there are other parts of the run that I'm not counting. Like I'm not going for the R cancel right now because it loses like one to two seconds. Just missing it and getting it is like, if you're really gonna go for it, and really try to get it, you can either lose your run to it or lose two seconds. So, because I don't need it to get a 43, I'm not really like attempting it right now, so. Yeah, that's a big reason why. I just can't get over how bad this graveyard was. What a choke, dude. Actually losing so much time. Like I could have gotten a sub 4420 if it weren't for that graveyard. I mean, you know what I'm gonna say already. This run wasn't even good, so it's okay. Surprised that this industrial park pulled this run back though. And after what? Okay, I guess this helped a little bit. I was plus 10 on 43 pace here. How'd this come all the way back? I actually don't even know what this split is that I gave here. These are just random splits that I made up with this route. This took way too long to get. Cruise boost. So this run this run was 43 able. We just lost like 15 in graveyard and like 15 to shit movement and a bunch of other stuff and like you know 30 probably 30 to I don't know. You get the idea. So very improvable. Very improvable. Still a very bad time. This run, yeah, definitely clearly shows the potential for 43. I'm not really... 
I don't feel better having gotten this. I really don't. I just I feel like I haven't gotten the run yet. So obviously this is still like you know this 4427 is like quite a bit better than the last one that I did, but it's still it's still only 11 seconds faster than my personal best with the previous like the, the jellyfish field stuff. And I've added a lot more time to save than that, so. Yeah, I'm using a faster route, but it's also a way harder route. Can't even... I can't overstate how much harder this route is than the last one. But man, that chest bounce choke... Oh, that was like... Oh my god. That was actually the difference between sub 4420. Because then I missed this cruise boost after that. A lot of missed cruise boosts in this level. If I had just held it together out of shipwreck, this would have been sub 4420. Easily. Easily. Not even close. I lost two seconds to the cruise boost in here. I, lo I legitimately lost 10 seconds between these Wait. two levels. For sure. And that was, like, after I missed these cruise boosts. This one. Oh, and I missed the one here, too. Yeah, I missed, like, every cruise boost in here. Thanks, C40, for the 480. Yeah. I just missed a ton of cruise boosts. And I don't know why I missed so many. I really don't know why. Yeah. Well, I, didn't, I didn't attempt the arc cancel because I don't need it to get a 43. It's not important for 43. It's a very risky strategy that you either save six seconds or you lose two seconds. It's really deep in the run. And I can definitely get 44, excuse me, sub 44 by a decent margin without doing it. So I don't really see it as being necessary to achieve the goal that I'm trying to achieve. Because here's the thing. On the average run, I'm going to need those two seconds more than I would need the six seconds on some, some runs, you know? Like, every second matters so much now that the risk of, the risk of losing two seconds to save six seconds occasionally is not worth it. And it's like, you have like three options. You save six seconds, you lose two seconds, or you lose your run. Though only one of those options is a good option. However, it's just so like, it's it's with the different LCB speeds and stuff, and like, it's just not a very consistent thing to go for that deep into the run. Like 30 something, 35 minutes in, something like that. It's not, it's not a smart thing to go for when you can just not lose two seconds, just not attempting it. Also, there's a rare instance where if you're going too fast with the LCB, you can just fall off the building and then you lose your entire run that way as well. Yeah, the R cancel was like... I don't know. I'm, I might need to use it as like a run saver at some point, but I don't know. Seeing as this run was on 43 pace, I kind of just threw it to cruise boosting and movement. Maybe we won't need it, who knows. But I just want to get a 43. That is my only goal. Because here's the thing, guys. I was watching the greatest hits reel. And just remembering, like, all the hardships and all the runs that were like... There are some really good runs that, like, we just don't remember because they weren't iconic. They weren't, like, the run or, like, the minute break or, like, the legendary minute break or whatever. Like, it doesn't really... If I get a 43 with whatever strats I use... The time is so tight, it's such an optimized time that it's going to be impressive no matter what, so... Whatever it takes to get it. We're just going for efficiency here, we're just trying to get it as quickly as possible. We're speed running 43. Basically. Oh, I just, like, get a run, save the splits as a separate file, edit stuff out. 
import the splits as a comparison. But like this comparison is like really dumb though, because I made it like today. I just edited a bunch of numbers and threw it in. Like, you know what, screw it. I just need some idea of like what I'm doing. This is how I feel. But uh, yeah. What was the industrial park exit? 2649. That's like, that's six seconds worse than my best today. Six seconds worse than my best today. That late game was just bad too. Really bad. It was almost decent until Graveyard. Graveyard. Graveyard was so bad. Graveyard was so bad. Oh. Alright, well. That was a 12 and a half hour stream, pretty much, and I like to get on in the afternoon now. So we're gonna actually end, and I'm gonna try to get this on YouTube, I'm gonna have some dinner, you know, tend to my wrists and everything. But I mean, this is like, for a, for a finished run, this was fine, I guess. Whatever. I'm not happy about the graveyard, I'm not happy about the start of the run. There are a few embarrassing things in there for sure. But I guess it's a, you know, personal best. I really don't care though. I even felt that way about the first 44. I was like, I really don't care. It didn't feel like it mattered that much. Alright. Take it easy everybody. I'll see you in the afternoon. Thank you for watching.